Hello, investors and traders, and welcome to the weekly market report with the Market Guys. I'm AJ Monte. This is a one year daily candle chart of the Russell 2000 index, ticker symbol RUT. And I'm starting off with this one because it's the broader index of the indices I'm going to cover today. And as you can see from the chart, the market pulled back exactly as I forecasted last week. Remember, that diagonal line was drawn last Friday when I put out the market report back then. And I said that we would pull back and then test whatever new support level is established at that time. So we have yet to find a new support level just yet. And we're going to have to watch to see what happens early next week to see how this plays out. But my forecast is going to be that I believe we're going to bounce a little bit from here, retest, and then pull back, breaking down below that support level. So I'm expecting a break of that support level. I'll leave these lines up here for next week so we can go back and analyze how it played out. But that's my forecast for Russell 2000. If you look at the Qs, ticker symbol QQQ, also known as the power shares, you're going to see the tech sector represented in the candle chart here, where, again, my lines from last week are in place. I said we would pull back. We came right back to that line. We pulled back from resistance. So I'm going to erase all of these lines now that we've gone through that price move and redraw what I think could very well happen. This is the new established resistance line. I think that initially we can come up in the tech sector, retest that line, and then come back down. Why am I more convinced to the downside? Well, the key point is the lower volume. Today was a pretty big upward move. The Dow was up, the Qs were up, the Russell 2000 was up, but the volume was lower than it was on the sell-off from Thursday. So that tells us that all that we saw here was a short covering rally and maybe a little bit more. There's no increase in volume that tells me new buyers are coming into the market. If you want to know the significance of how volume plays into the equation, make sure you go to our video page on the Market Guys website and look at price and volume and how they work together. Volume is a leading indicator. It's not a lagging indicator. And it's one of the few leading indicators that we can rely on week after week. Now, if we look at the spiders, take a simple SPY, that you also see my lines that were drawn from last week. You'll see we pulled back right in line with that angle of pullback that I suggested. We see that the volume on the spiders is higher. So what does that mean? Yeah, for the spiders, the buyers are still in force, but the resistance is still in place. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove my drawing from last week. I'm going to remove this line right here, which is former resistance. I'm going to redraw a new resistance point, and this is what I think could happen with the spiders. Think a little bit higher to retest resistance, and again, I think we're going to go lower because the broad-based indices are showing more bearish signals than bullish. The spiders, remember, only 500 stocks in that index. Russell 2000, obviously 2,000 stocks. Now, if we look at the diamonds, that's ticker symbol DIA, the Dow Jones Industrial Average ETF, you'll see that, again, same thing played out. Market pulled back according to the way I said it would. Where's that forecast right there? We bounced off of the support level. I'm going to remove these lines, redraw what I think could happen here. Again, same thing, a little bit of an up move, retest resistance, come back. Why? Again, look at the diamonds, look at the volume. Right now, the Qs are the only ones that had the higher volume. The rest of the markets showing successively lower volume, just like we did back here. Notice, price went up, volume went down. The drop in volume was the leading indicator to the sell-off right here, which was a bearish engulfing pattern. I've reported that on my Twitter page, by the way. Uh, that all markets had bearish engulfing patterns on that day, which was Monday, and the sell-off followed right there. 
So again, watch volume, very, very important leading indicator. Now finally, the VIX, ticker symbol VIX. The VIX is also a leading indicator. Notice my forecast. I said we would go up, we would test resistance right there. Remember, the VIX is opposite of the S&P, so it's contrarian to in price. And we went right almost to the penny of that resistance line that I drew and then pulled back. So where does that leave us right now? I'm going to remove my previous line of forecast. This is a down VIX, which means up S&P. I think that the VIX has found a level of support. So let's follow me here because I don't want to lose any new investors who are just being introduced to the VIX. If you have a support level on the VIX and the VIX goes down to test that support and then rallies up from support, remember, a bullish VIX is bearish for the general markets. Again, another leading indicator. If you're interested in learning more about some of the things I've mentioned, go to themarketguys.com, click on the video page right there, and you'll see a library of videos that will show you and explain to you some of the concepts I've mentioned. Make sure that if you also decide to subscribe to our market reports, I would suggest that once you do that, then you download the WhatsApp application to your mobile device. In other words, what happens is if you download this application, when I send out a trade alert, again, that's a subscription-based trade alert service, but once you have subscribed to the service, you can then get my alert pushed to your mobile device so that you will not miss a single trade. This is a great application that you can use to stay abreast of the markets. So that's my weekly market report. Have a great weekend, and we'll speak with you soon. So long. For almost three decades, A.J. Monty has motivated audiences worldwide about creating personal wealth and winning in business. His time-tested risk management strategies focus on ideas that involve a keep it super simple approach, also known as the KISS principle. These concepts have been delivered to people in over 16 countries around the world, reaching audiences in the millions. AJ is a best-selling author of two books, The Market Guy's Five Points for Trading Success and Take Charge of Your Money Now, both of which have been featured on PBS Television, Fox Business News, ABC TV, as well as Sirius Money Radio. As a financial educator and consultant, he has worked with some of the most recognized names in the financial industry. Companies like Bank of America, Charles Schwab, E-Trade Financial, Scotiabank, and TD Ameritrade's Thinkorswim. If you have ever been challenged with having to make a tough decision regarding when to buy or sell a stock, then help is on the way. The Options Oracle and Equity Oracle Alert Services are designed to help you make those tough decisions. AJ will not only help you find the best trade candidates, but he will also lay out the exit strategy for each position in an easy to understand format that anyone can follow. Hi, my name is AJ Monte, Chief Market Strategist for The Market Guys. For almost 30 years, I've traded stocks, options, futures, and even currencies. I've traveled the world teaching people just like you how to profit in the market using time-tested strategies that focus on risk management. You see, the secret to making money in the market depends on your ability to limit losses when you're wrong. In other words, if you want to make a lot of money in the market, don't lose a lot of money in the market. Now that may sound funny, but it's true. Most investors are challenged with two questions. The first question is, how do you find a good stock? Well, the best way to find the right stock starts with eliminating all of the stocks you would not invest in. This process of elimination is called stock screening. And our services help you overcome the odds so you're putting your money where the money is going. We're simply following the trends. The second question most people ask of me is, when is it time to sell? Well, if you don't have an answer to this question, then you might find yourself in a position where you're holding on to your stocks when things go against you. This is the worst thing you could possibly do because I believe this is no longer a buy and hold market. It has evolved into a buy and protect market. Holding on and hoping for things to get better is not a strategy. In fact, doing this will eventually lead you to a catastrophic loss and you wouldn't want that. 
Our trade alert services help answer these two questions. Not only will I help you find the right trade candidate, but I'll also show you how to use the charts to manage risk. I don't use the charts to predict the future, I use them to protect the future. The charts tell me when it's time to get out as well as when it's time to get in. And that's what I'd like to teach you as well. We have two services, the Equity Oracle and the Options Oracle. The Equity Oracle is an alert service for traders who would like to trade only equities, whereas the Options Oracle is our premier alert service for both equity and option traders. Each alert is laid out in an easy to understand format that shows charts depicting entry and exit points. Risk management is our cornerstone of each service so you don't have to struggle with the decision of when to get out or when a trade goes against you, when should I take my loss. The strategy is to use the KISS principle, keeping it super simple. As a bonus, you'll have access to a live Q&A session as well, each and every month. This is where you can submit a stock symbol and I will analyze these stocks while we discuss the best trading strategies for each position. And it gets better. In addition to the alert service and the live monthly Q&A sessions, we're also developing a member page that will include instructional videos about how to get the most out of our service. Without question, this is the best trade alert service available on the market and we look forward to having you as our newest subscriber. Simply click on the link below to subscribe. It's easy. Once again, I'm AJ Monty, Chief Market Strategist for the Market Guys. Thanks for watching. Enrolling in the service is easy. Simply click on the link below to subscribe, and your weekly alert will be delivered right to your email box. And if you act now, we will include AJ's best selling book, The Market Guys Five Points for Trading Success. This is a first time offer that will get you on the road to success and keep you there. Remember, if you continue to do what you've always done, things will never change. Positive results will only come after you've taken the first step in the right direction. We look forward to having you as our newest member.